A fearful Thurston mom is speaking out tonight after temporarily taking her daughter out of school due to alleged violent threats from another student. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Templeman. Renee McCullough has the night off. KZI 9 News reporter Grace Smith joins us live from the high school after hearing what this parent has to say and what school officials are doing about it. Grace. Matt, I sat down with Katherine Brown, who is not happy. She walked me through a series of violent threats made by a boy from school and says the school needs to do more. Brown tells me her daughter came home a few weeks ago saying a boy started talking about Kip Kinkle at the lunch table, a disturbing reference to a mass killer who shot up the school in 1998. A few weeks later, the boy allegedly talked about killing a girl out of jealousy and hanging her body on the school sign. He then said he wanted to kill his art teacher with a hammer, according to Brown. She tells me the school says he is no longer in class and is getting the help he needs, but that he could come back. Brown is upset by this, and she is thinking of having her daughter officially transferred. There should be a zero tolerance policy. These things being said are what cause horrific things to happen. People don't just say these things. These are not jokes. Brown tells me she hopes every parent will be aware of this situation and that the student will not be allowed to come back. And school officials tell me that there was no weapon or even a threat of a weapon on campus and that a note was sent out to parents warning them about this investigation. And we will keep you updated as we get more information. But for now, reporting live in Springfield, Grace Smith, KEZI 9 News. Grace, thank you.